We're going to go over the proper startup procedure for an EG4 battery with an EG4 inverter. Uh, the batteries have a built-in pre-charge resistor um, and it's important that that be used to actually start the inverter otherwise you risk uh, blowing capacitors. So we're going to go over the, the proper procedure. You'll notice I have all of the breakers off currently. So the proper procedure is actually to turn all of the breakers on for the, on the battery side. So we're going to turn that breaker on. We're going to come down here and turn that breaker on. And at this point, there is a complete circuit from the battery to the inverter to start it up. The next thing we're going to do is turn on the BMS. This will activate the pre-charge resistor, which gives a slow charge to the capacitors before applying full power. So you see the battery just came on, and now the inverter is coming on. Ignore the warning and fault light. As you can see, I don't have anything else wired to this. Um, so it's complaining that there's no grid and uh, the communications aren't working and no PV, all of that stuff. 